Hey, this is Brett. Hope everybody's having a great day out there today. And I am super excited to go over this ultra clean 2020 Ram 3500 Crew Cab Long Box Laramie Level 1 Package. This is stock number 14735Z. I am here at Summit Automotive in Fond du Lac, Wisconsin, your new and used heavy duty truck and Ram headquarters. This 2020 Ram 3500 has the 6.7 liter high output Cummins diesel engine, has 400 horsepower, 1,000 foot pounds of torque, and it's paired up with the Ison heavy duty six speed automatic transmission. This truck has been fully safety and inspected by our service shop, has a fresh oil and filter change. All the fluids have been checked and topped off. It has six like new tires, and this truck is 100% ready to go. This is a clean title history two owner out of Florida. I'm gonna go all the way around in this video, inside, underneath, start it up, take a look under the hood, show you all the options and give you the most accurate representation that I can of this vehicle. Diamond black crystal pearl is the color. Paint code is PXJ. I shoot all my videos in 4K and if you like the video, subscribe to the YouTube channel, click the bell notifications, get updates on the videos I do each and every day, as well as having access to one of the largest catalogs of vehicle walkarounds on YouTube and stay current on our ever-changing and vast heavy-duty truck inventory so you do not miss out on gems like this one. This one has the 17-inch alloy wheels. Now these have been coated, looks like a plasti dip of some type, um, and I'm assuming they're chrome underneath or uh, polished aluminum. Has Firestone Transforce AT2 tires. These are LT285 60R17s. And these tires are like new. They have just about all the tread left. I'd say 90, 95% of the tread left on those tires. Frame and the underbody is exceptionally clean, which is you, what you would expect on a truck from Florida. Front fender is in excellent condition as well. Somebody has also blacked out the uh, 3500 badge and the Cummins logo on there. LED headlamps, LED running lights, and LED fog lamps. Front bumpers in excellent condition as well. And that looks to have been uh, painted. Somebody tried really hard to make this a night edition. This is not a night edition, um, but they have painted the front bumper. It has the front bumper parking sensors. You do get the chrome ram lettering on the grill there. And the hood is in excellent condition. I didn't see any major dents or dings on there, looks really good. Passenger side front fender is in excellent condition as well. And the passenger side wheel has been coated as well. The only thing really to note is it looks like there's maybe a little scratch underneath that coating there. You can see that tire is very no new as well. And you can see diamond black crystal pearls, one of my favorite blacks on the market of any truck. It's got a lot of metal flake in it, a lot of gold, and even some uh, pinks and green flakes, but that gold really pops in the sunlight, really a cool color. As you go down this side of this 2020 Ram 3500, take note of how clean the body is and how reflective and mirror-like that paint is. I take these HD videos, so if you are far away or even if you're close by and you just cannot make the trip down, but you're still interested in purchasing the truck, you can see the truck, hear the truck, and have confidence in the vehicle that you're looking at before you even get here. So when you do get here, there's absolutely no surprises and you can make a smart and informed buying decision from wherever you're at. And if this video helps you make that buying decision, let your salesman know that you saw the video, that it was helpful and that Brett sent you. Very nice down that side. You do get the uh, 3M rock guard on the front of the dually tub here and I didn't see any rock chips or anything on that dually tub. The back wheels have been painted black as well. And the back tires are just as new as the front tires. You can still see the little wear knobs on there from being new. And the frame and underbody, once again, what you'd expect from a Florida truck. Has all the remaining factory exhaust, so it hasn't been altered in any way. And once again, lower rockers all look really good. Comes with some painted black step bars to match the black theme on this truck. Get the fender flares there, part of the Laramie package, and the LED tail lamps. Coming around to the back of the vehicle, rear bumper's in pretty nice shape. It does have the backup parking sensors. Full towing package, which includes the receiver, hitch, four pin, and seven pin wiring. 
and the tailgate is in really nice condition as well. Comes with a flex by undercover fold up tonneau. It has the power drop down tailgate, comes with the spray and bed liner, fifth wheel and gooseneck prep package. You also have LED bed lighting back here, seven pin and four pin wiring and side box tie downs. The bed itself is in really nice condition. And if you're going to be hauling a camper, it's nice to have that fifth wheel and gooseneck prep package. Inside the tailgate has that spray and bed liner on it as well. And as we go to the driver's side, just as clean as that passenger side. No major dents or dings on the box. His back wheel's in nice shape as well. And really the only thing to disclose is there's one little nick on the rear fender there. Uh, fender flare, I should say, but that's really the only thing to disclose on this truck. And down the rest of the driver's side, the cab and doors all look really good. Does have the heated fold-up tow mirrors, blind, blind spot monitoring, uh, directional signals on there. It does have the tow technology package, which gives you the 360 cam, the LED side lights. I'll show you all that. Just a little bit, it has the enter and go system, so you just have to have the key fob in your pocket to automatically unlock. And I'll take a look at the back seats here. You get the black Alcantara suede and leather seats. No rips or tears on them. Power sliding rear window with the built-in rear defrost. You get the gray piping on the headrests and seats there. They fold up. You get a load floor back here, which is nice. You got muddy boots or tools, put your Put them on there, you're not going to get your seats dirty. Or if you got pets, put both sides down. They got a nice flat place to lay and they won't get your seats dirty. Storage under this side, subwoofer under that side. You get the Berber floor mat back here. In-floor storage with removable bins for easy cleaning. You can put ice and drinks in there. It's like you have too many coolers wherever you go. If you're not in Wisconsin, just extra storage space. Two USBs, two USB-Cs, and 115 volt, 400 watt plug-in back here. Child safety locks on the back doors and the inside and bottoms of the doors. Just as nice as the rest of the truck. There's the VIN sticker. No Canadian trucks here. And the tire and loading information sticker. Up front you get the same black leather and Alcantara suede. Mesh seating, you get the bucket seats in the front, you get the Laramie stitched into the backrest, and you get the gray piping on there as well. Both these seats are heated, cooled, and power, and you get driver's side lumbar, factory floor mats, auto headlamps, power pedals, power windows, locks, and mirrors, suede bolster, wood grain trim. These mirrors do power fold in. I always like showing both sides so you know that both sides are working properly. And then you get the power blind spot mirror. If you check out that mirror on the left there, you can see that you can control that, which is really nice, especially for the passenger side, because it's hard to control, hard to adjust that while you're sitting there. So that's really nice for that. And you can see you get the seven inch LCD display and that this truck has 35,645 miles. You do get the seven inch Display with the digital speedometer, compass display, instrument cluster is very nice and clean. Smells very clean inside this truck. I don't think it's been smoked in. And you get the heated leather wrap steering wheel, cruise controls on the right, gear selector on the right as well, Bluetooth and information center controls on the left hand, audio controls on the back of that steering wheel. You get the Ison six speed automatic transmission with the optional tap shift, which is right there. The push button start, push button four wheel drive. This one has the Alpine premium sound system. And you get to the Uconnect 4C 12 inch radio, has the factory navigation system on it. There's Highway 41, so that is working nicely. Always something you want to make sure that's working on these radios. Um, AM, FM, Sirius, XM radio capabilities, as well as USB hookups. And you get your climate controls on here, which includes the dual climate controls. You also have your heated and cooled seat buttons, heated steering wheel button, and then you can check out all your cameras here. So you got the backup cam, which is a really nice feature. And then you have the cargo cam. So when that tonneau covers open, you can see what's going on inside the bed. And then you have down the side of the, of the truck. So if you're backing up a camper or trailer or something, imagine how great it would be to take a look at where you're backing up to if there's gonna be anything in your way. I wish my truck had that. 
and probably my next truck will have that for sure. It's one of those features that I think uh, I really would use a lot. So here are all your apps, um, basically just links to different parts of the radio. It does have projection manager where you can project your cell phone to the screen via Android Auto or Apple CarPlay. We did a demo on a 4C 8.4 radio, small, smaller radio, same uh, operating system, but we did a demo with Android Auto. If you want to check that out, that's in the upper right hand part of the screen. And down here is your factory brake controller, six auxiliary upfit switches, tow haul mode, factory exhaust brake, and two uh, buttons for your front and rear parking sensors, two USBs, two USB-Cs, and an AUX jack, and down there is a 115 volt, 400 watt plug-in. Get your keyless entry with remote start and power drop down tailgate button, and you get your sliding cup holder and coin tray. Passenger side glove boxes are in nice shape, as is the carpeting and floor mat. Passenger side seat is in excellent condition as well. Once again, smells very clean inside this truck. You get the speakers in the ceiling, part of that Alpine premium sound system. Assistant SOS buttons, map lights, power drop down tailgate button, and power sign rear window controls, auto dimming mirror, and your home link buttons are right there for your garage door security systems and lighting systems. All right. Let's start it up and take a look under the hood. Starts right up, no check engine lights or anything like that. I did forget to show you, you have all these other cameras. So you have a close up of your rear bumper, a wide view of the rear bumper, a wide view of the front bumper, and then a narrow view of the front bumper. So those are the other um, controls for those cameras. Once again, all part of the tow technology group. Then you get LED side lights in those mirrors. They are very bright to go down the back side of the truck. And I would personally like to thank you for checking out the video today. Hopefully from this HD video, you've been able to verify the quality condition options. And of course, cleanliness of this truck all the way around inside and out. And hopefully you enjoyed it and learned something about this vehicle. Cab lights all working nicely as well. Under the hood, we have the 6.7 liter high output Cummins diesel engine, 400 horsepower, 1,000 foot pounds of torque. Engine bay is very clean, runs very smooth. Once again, this truck has been fully safety and inspected by our service shop. Has a fresh oil and filter change. All the fluids have been checked and topped off. Has six like new tires. And there is the emission sticker. And this truck is 100% ready to go. Let's do a final walk around here and check with all those lights on. I would highly recommend this truck from a quality and condition standpoint. This thing is nicely optioned out, looks really good, paint is in excellent condition, LED tail lamps, and uh, just a very, very nice high output heavy duty Cummins diesel. And to see more pictures of this truck or one of our other 550 new and used cars, trucks, SUVs, minivans, Wranglers, half tons, three quarter tons, one tons. You name it, we got it. Go to the website right there, summitauto.com. Full pictures and descriptions of every single vehicle all at summitauto.com. And if you want to check out more HD videos, you can go to youtube.com slash summitauto. Click the bell notifications, get updates on the videos I do each and every day, as well as having access to one of the largest catalogs of vehicle and heavy-duty truck walk-arounds on YouTube. And stay current on our ever-changing and vast heavy-duty truck inventory so you do not miss out on gems like this one. In fact, in a second, you'll see a link to subscribe to my YouTube channel in the upper left. A link to all the Ram 3500 truck videos I've done in the upper right. A link to this vehicle on our website in the lower left. And a link to one of our latest YouTube videos in the lower right. Click those, check us out. We're super excited to help you with this ultra clean 2020 Ram 3500 crew cab long box, dual rear wheel, Laramie level one with the tow technology group in diamond black crystal pearl. Thank you so much for checking out the video. Hope you enjoyed it. Remember to like, subscribe, and share on the YouTube channel. I'd really appreciate it. Thanks again. Have a great day.